There are a few things you need to know. These cards are free. They're being issued automatically, so you don't have to sign up, and your benefits and your services will not change. But one thing is different. Your Medicare number is no longer your Social Security number on your card, and there is a good reason for that. Each year, about 2 million Americans have their medical identity stolen. And if thieves can get their hands on your name, social security number, and a few other basics, they can file fake insurance claims, fill prescriptions, even pay for surgeries in your name. So to lower that risk, Medicare is revamping its red, white, and blue cards used by 56 million Americans, 65 and older. What we normally tell our beneficiaries and people with Medicare is, when you get this new card, start using it immediately. Dr. Renard Murray, consortium administrator for the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services, says the new Medicare cards look similar to the old ones, but they no longer include your social security number or your signature. Because criminals are getting a little bit more savvy than they were in the past. And so now you're seeing a lot more uh, uh, situations where people are being victimized because of fraud and identity theft. And so we've seen a lot of that, but nonetheless, we're hoping that this is going to minimize a lot of that. Instead of using your social security number, you'll now have a randomly assigned member number that's not so closely linked to your personal information. When you get the new card, it's immediately effective. So our systems have already been programmed to accept those new numbers. Dr. Murray says the cards are shipping out to Georgians now, so look for them in the mail over the next few weeks. And so when you get the card, immediately destroy your old one. And if you don't know how to destroy it, we've got information on our website that tells you how to destroy the old card. Because that has a social security number on it. You don't want to destroy that in the garbage can. And if you've recently signed up for Medicare, you may have already received your new card. If you haven't gotten it, don't panic. They're just starting to ship here in Georgia, and that rollout will take about a month. If you have questions about your new Medicare card, Medicare has a website and a hotline, and you'll find the information for both of those on fox5atlanta.com. Just look for this story. For the Fox Medical Team, I'm Beth Galvin.